So here's a little example of a little relay power switching board uh, using an ASP8066 Wi-Fi chip. Um, you can see there's a little power supply coming in here, a little test load here. Um, and here's a little dashboard that I've set up using OpenHAB. This is running on my PC and serving up a little internal web page back to my iPad here. So you can see the sort of dashboard that you might typically build using OpenHAB. Here you can see I've got power, temperature, current and voltage. So I can sort of switch on that little switch here. That'll switch on my load and we can then, if I can get that, that'll switch off. And that um, gives you a sort of um, example of a control in OpenHAB, which is using MQTT at the back end. Uh, you can see that there's a temperature sensor and voltage and current acquisition. So you can see there's a few components there next to the relay um, that's doing acquisition of the voltage and current waveforms. So you can do things like um, energy um, logging. I haven't quite implemented the code for those yet, so they're not working at the moment. Um, you see there's a second node there, which is this little ESP8266 um, breakout board, little prototype board that's standing in as the second node. So you can sort of see if I switch that off, the little LED will switch off, and it'll switch back on, switch it off. If I go back to node 1 here, that's on and off. Um, so that's um, just a little example of a typical sort of application you might use using an ASP8266 and a relay in a home automation application with um, OpenHAB at the front end for the dashboard and um, MQTT at the back end on the server.